Here, at the heart of the Empire, the Queen, the lifeblood of her people, tirelessly ensured their future. But even in the deepest chambers, vigilance was paramount. For threats, both known and... Like a ripple through hidden pond, the alarm spread, turning the Empire's tranquil rhythm into a frantic hum of warning. The Empire's defenders, hardened by countless skirmishes, prepared to face the shadow that now loomed at their doorstep. Into the darkness they ventured, a brave few, their purpose clear, to unveil the face of their new adversary. And there it was. A monstrous, alien invader, a harbinger of... With the terrible truth confirmed, their perilous journey back began, carrying a message that would shake the very foundations of their empire. The dire news reached the Queen, and a tremor ran through the heart of the empire. The era of peace. No war is won by numbers alone. Tactical brilliance forged in the silent deli- While the soldiers prepared for battle, the workers fortified their home, transforming the soft earth into an impenetrable fortress. A small victory, but a vital one. It proved the mettle of the ant warriors and gave them crucial intelligence. But the dry wood termites were relentless. A tide of pale destruction, they carved new- The empire responded with cunning and industry, twisting the very earth to their will, creating traps and strongholds against the relentless tide. At the narrowest pass, the two empires met in a brutal test of will. Sometimes, victory is found not in holding the line, but in choosing the ground of battle. A calculated retreat, a deadly invitation. The earth itself became their weapon. The trap sprung, swallowing the enemy whole, a testament to the ant's formidable intellect and unity. With the immediate threat neutralized, the empire quickly moved to consolidate its gains, fortifying the newly won ground with tireless resolve. But the enemy learned and adapted. From the depths, new, more fearsome. Against raw force, the ants deployed their greatest weapon. The war demanded sacrifice, but it also demanded life. New generations, still in their tyrant empire, braced itself. The whispers of war had grown into a thunderous roar, and the greatest battle in their... The first line shattered under the relentless onslaught. But even in retreat, the ants fought for every inch. Against impossible odds, a few brave souls stood as an unyielding wall, their sacrifice a shield for the retreating empire. Even amidst the chaos of retreat, the future of the empire remained paramount. paramount. The queen, the heart of her people, felt every tremor of defeat, every loss. Deep within their ancient earth, the ants erected their final stand, a fortress. Then the enemy arrived, a living, crawling tide of destruction. They f A silence fell, heavy with the weight of destiny. Then, the earth erupted, a living tide of pale fury, the desert subterranean termites. But the ants held, a disciplined, unyielding wall of chitin and fury. They met the storm with a strength forged in unity. A monstrous blow, the wall groaned, then buckled, a breach. But the leafcutter ants were more than warriors. They were builders, healers, and strategists. A new threat, or a potential ally. The air crackled with unspoken challenge. Against a common foe, 
ancient rivalries were set aside. Unified against their common enemy, the combined might of two empires now stood ready. The tide of war was about. With a unified roar, they charged. A storm of chitin and mandibles unleashed. More than brute force, it was the cunning of the ants that turned the tide. Each movement, a stroke of genius, isolating and overwhelming their foes. Even in retreat, the enemy fought with a primal, desperate fury. A last gasp of chaos against the tide of ordered advance. Then, the Earth betrayed its own. A strategic masterstroke, collapsing the enemy's lifeline. Trapped and without hope, the remaining enemy fought with the ferocity of the damned. A final, desperate stand against the inevitable, the head of the serpent. With its fall, the will of the enemy shattered. A decisive blow, sealing the fate of the invasion. With the enemy's heart broken, the Ant Empire reclaimed its lost lands, rebuilding and fortifying. The war had forged a new reality. Old enmities softened as the greater... From the crucible of war, a new, greater empire was born. Unif... Peace, once won, is rarely eternal. From the world, a creature of immense power, a living mountain. Its shadow alone could crush an entire... Its hunger, immense. Its power, undeniable. An entire foraging party swept away in a single... A new kind of terror. A force of nature. The Queen. Against overwhelming might, the Empire turned to its brightest minds. For every weakness, a strategy. From observation came innovation. The very Earth, once their home, would now become a labyrinth of tr Against a foe so vast, conventional warfare was suicide. Only precise, coordinated strikes at the behemoth's weaknesses could prevail. A perilous gamble, baiting the behemoth, drawing its wrath towards a hidden snare, risking all for the survival of the Empire. The Earth opened, a hungry maw, swallowing the Titan whole. A trap of epic proportions. Immobilized, but not defeated, the ants swarmed, a thousand tiny blades striking at the chinks in its armor. A, a titan's death throes. Its immense power unleashed in a final desperate rampage. The titan had fallen. Against unimaginable odds, the empire had prevailed. From death, new life. The fallen titan became a treasure trove, its mitre shell and flesh. With new resources flowing in, the empire flourished. The queen, architect of their destiny. Deep within the newly charted depths, where the earth's pulse was barely felt. The empire's keenest minds were called upon to unravel the enigma. A new frontier of knowledge, hidden within the earth's very core. A power beyond their ken. The crystal, a puzzle. Its meaning, a prophecy. Then the earth itself rebelled. Tremors unlike any before ripped through. Against an unknown colossal force, the empire made its ultimate stand. Every... Then, then, the Earth parted, revealing not a single foe, but a nightmare made... All their preparations, all their courage, now tested against a foe beyond... Its speed, a blur, its power, absolute. The first strike, oh. Against impossible odds, they charged. A living torrent of fury swarming the titan's legs. From her throne, the queen watched. Every life, every struggle. When all seemed lost, a desperate plan took root. 
a perilous ascent. A to the surface they ascended, a world of dazzling light and colossal forms. The bait taken, the titan enraged, burst forth, unleashing Uri upon the ultimate gamble, the ultimate trap. The earth, their ally, now ensnared the... Now, the Empire unleashed its full wrath. A million mandibles, a single will. A titan's last dance, a storm of fury against the relentless tide. And then, silence. The great beast fell, its terrible reign ex... The message arrived, simple yet profound. The beast was slain. And so, the Empire rejoiced. A celebration of unity, of sacrifice. Victory came at a cost. In silent vigil, the Empire remission. The scars of war were deep, but the spirit of the Empire was indomitable. With renewed vi Not just their home, but the very surface world had been wounded. And so, the Empire became From the ashes of conflict, a new spring blossomed. The Queen, the Eternal... With peace secured. Across new horizons, the Empire cast its reach. New outposts, beacons of their... The bonds forged in battle deepened in peace. Two empires, once rivals, the pursuit of knowledge yielded its own rewards. A new discovery, a new resource, promising The world above, once a source of terror, now a realm of endless opportunity. The Empire had found its true balance. Each ant, each faction, a vital thread in the... Their influence, though unseen, rippled across the surface. A hidden empire not just within the earth. A hidden empire, forged in fire, triumphant in unity. The hidden empire, now forever woven into the tapestry of the world.